Hi everybody, welcome back to our seventh French horn lesson. We have made it so far. Uh, we're going to do a review very quickly because I feel like we're making some very good progress. We're going to do a very quick warm up. So buckle in, we're going quick. And we are going to go over the second line of our etude and play it all together. So really quickly, let us go through our warm up. We're speeding along today. So let's do our sirens on our mouthpiece. Try that with me. Awesome. Let's try our roller coasters. Good job. Let's do a really quick calm response. job let's do our long tones on our mouthpiece remember we use two when we're on the horn so let's start on g how about we do this we're going to hold each note out as a whole note so each note is going to get four beats and i'll give you the tempo before we start make sure you just keep it so we're going to do g f e d and c remember that is open one open one open each note gets four beats. Five, six, breathe. Good job. Let's try that going back up. So starting on C and going up to G. Five, six, breathe. Make sure you breathe throughout that. Cool. I think we're all feeling pretty warmed up. We've got our tongues moving. We've got our faces all stretched out. Really quickly, if you've been playing for a little while today, I just want to go over a couple exercises we can do to help our jaws relax. Put your fingers right here and give yourself a little massage. Do a couple of these. Like horses. And then we're going to go over emptying our spit really quickly. Uh, grab your spit valve if you have one. You're lucky. Hold it open. Give it a nice blow. See what comes out. Make the flutes really grossed out. Awesome. Now we're going to move to our etude. Very quick warm up today. You guys got this. So last week we went over the very first line, the top line, and we wrote in all of our fingerings and all of our note names. So I want to run through uh, the top line like we did together last lesson. So I'm going to play the first measure and then you're going to play it after me. We're going to do another call and response. Here we go. Five, six. <sighs> first line together let's see if we can play it at the same time and then play it all the way through without any breaks I think we can here we go from the beginning I'll count us off and I will give us a metronome too probably here we go <laughs> Cool, we went 
for that top line together. Now, the first two measures of the bottom line probably look very similar. And they probably look like you've played them before, and that's because you have. So let's see if we can play that together. I'll play the measure, you repeat the measure. Same thing that we've been doing. Five, six, breathe. Your turn. Your turn. Cool. Now, this is where it gets a little tricky. We're going to start on a G and we're going to go down to a C. So remember our G, open. F, one, E, open, D, one, and then C are all open. Let's go through that really slow. We just did that for our long term warm up, so I think we'll do that again. Four notes for each beat going down from a G to a C. Watch my fingers if you need to. Five, six, breathe. <sighs> Oh, let's try that one again. Five, six, breathe. Now that you have those notes and their fingerings in your head, let's see if we can do that all as quarter notes. Same thing, just quarter notes, so each note gets one beat. Five, six. Breathe. Again. Again. Now that we have that under our literal fingers, we're going to start on that G again, and then we're going to play our last measure as C, 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 quarter, quarter, half. Starting on the G in the second to last measure and going to the end. Breathe. One more time for good luck. I think I could be wrong, but I have a really good feeling that we could play through this whole etude. Let's try it one time. I'll play the measure, then you play the measure. Then I'll play the next one, then you'll play the next one. Just so we are perfectly ready for our full run of our etude. Here's our metronome. Remember, it's call and response. So repeat after me. Nice job! I'm very excited. The thing that might be messing you up is the E to the G. So really quick, let's just go from E to G, tongued a couple times. Like this. is in measure six to seven. I feel like we could run this through together the whole time. Let's try it out. Make sure you take deep, big breaths through your belly button as we go. Here we go. Five, six, breathe. Ooh. Mm -hmm. 
Give yourselves a big pat on the back if you can. That was excellent. I'm really proud of you guys for learning such a difficult and yet wonderful instrument in such a short amount of time. Please reach out if you have any questions and thank you for watching. Bye.